Hi, it's Matt, and this time I've got three tips to make you more productive in Word using Copilot. I'm gonna summarize the content of a document. I'm gonna rewrite parts of the content and experiment with different writing styles, and I'll transform some text into a table. I'll do all that in no time at all using Copilot for Microsoft 365. So let's have a look and see how it works. My first tip is summarizing. Here I have a Word document that's describing a new product called Stable24. It's just a brief overview of the features and benefits of the product and tells me how to get it. I'm short on time, so it'd be really nice if I could get a summary of what's in the doc. And to get that summary, I'm just gonna go up to the Home tab here in Word and choose the Copilot button. The Copilot pane opens up on the right, and I can see that one of the default prompts is to summarize this doc. For speed, I can just choose that and Copilot will get to work on the summary. The result is that Copilot has summarized the main ideas for me here. And it's chosen what style that's in. But I could ask for the summary in a different tone if I wanted. Because I think the language here is a little bit stiff. So I'll ask Copilot to write it again but use more casual language. To do that, I just need to change my prompt to be more specific. I'm gonna ask it to summarize this document in five bullets and in a casual style. Okay, so that looks better. Now there's a phrase here, game-changing, that I'm not sure about. And I want to get a better understanding of what game changing means when it's used in this doc. So I'm going to prompt Copilot to explain game changing to me. And when it does, it can tell me what it means and how and why it's used in this doc. OK, very good. Tip two is rewriting. There are times when you want to take what's in your doc already and try different styles to see if it can be made clearer or more professional. And to rewrite a paragraph, all I need to do is select it and then choose the Copilot button that appears next to it on the page. Then I'm gonna choose the Rewrite with Copilot option here, and it will draft a number of different options for me to review. And I can page through them to see which one I like. Now, if I like one of the suggested drafts, I can use the replace button to remove the existing text and add in Copilot's version. Or I can insert the draft below the text and have them both there for comparison. And this could be handy if I'm not sure and I want to decide later which one's best, or I want someone else to look and help me choose. If I didn't like any of the suggestions, I can always regenerate the results. Choosing the Regenerate button will refresh all the drafts. And if I want to change the style of the suggestions, I can drop down the Adjust Tone list here. I can see the default tone is Neutral, and I'm going to switch it to Casual, and then regenerate the drafts. Copilot rewrites the text in a casual style. On to tip three. Now I'm gonna use Copilot to turn some text into a table. I'm going to highlight the bullets here, choose the Copilot button, and then choose Visualize as a Table. Now it's created the table for me, which looks really good, but it's not just table formatting that is done here. Copilot worked out which items in the text are features, and added them to one column. And then it's added a description column and written me a description for each of those features. And that way of presenting those bullets is much easier for me to read. Now, once the table is created, I can choose to keep it if I'm happy with it and then clear up the existing text later. Or I can regenerate the table, which usually just tweaks the text a little bit. Now finally, you can tune the table as well to change the tone of the text. So I'm gonna type make it funny here and it will regenerate the table text again, this time with a more casual style. 
Okay, there you have three tips to make you more productive using Copilot for Microsoft 365 in Word. We saw how you can summarize a document in different tones, how to quickly rewrite parts of the document, and how to visualize the text as a table to make it more readable. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.